So I'm showing you today our power shaft. This is how the power shaft works. It comes with three blades and a protective cover. Super easy to use. Put the cover in. It locks in place. And the motor. And there you go. To keep it steady. And tonight, we're also making the cauliflower rice. So I have a chopped cauliflower. This is a whole head of cauliflower that we're doing. And so we're just chopping it all in. Maybe need to make an extra room for just a little bit. And see how it goes. This is super easy. You can chop and mince, whip, anything in here. The Power Chef can emulsify um, as well, so you can make a lot of um, dressing ingredients and recipe. You can even make your own mayonnaise if you want to. The cloud flour is super easy to shred and chop as fine as this one. And you can do your broccoli salad in here, grated carrots, mashed potatoes in less than 10 seconds. So there you go. This is how you use your power chef. And we're going to proceed with the rest of the cooking. We're making a cauliflower rice coming from our brand new Hot Mama recipe book. And looks so yummy and tasty and super easy and healthy to make. So our recipe also calls for grated carrots. And when I'm grating this mashed carrots, I use my um, grater, master grater from Tupperware. So all you have to do is basically put all the food that you need to be grated. You can put it all at once. But with our carrots, I put all of them in and just turn push and turn and this is how quick carrots are grated in here and these are about two cups of carrots that are grated in a few seconds so whenever I have a big um, job or batch to cook I always use my master grater So we're using our um, saute pan from Tupperware with the Chef Series collection. I had some sesame oil um, and then I added the grated carrots, some frozen corns, and some frozen peas. And then I'm gonna just stir fry that a little bit until it's just a little bit softer for two minutes at least. are softer or slightly cooked add the rest of the ingredients so we're adding all of our cauliflower and then we're adding some drop cumin cumin um, about a half a teaspoon of cumin and of course three eggs slightly beaten and then I'm just gonna let it cook for a little bit and then add them all over the cauliflower So the 
Chef Series um, saute pan is actually my favorite or most mostly used um, pan or casserole. It is a great size. It is big for a casserole or big for just stir fry or um, big or small job. So I really love this. It does come with a um, tempered glass cover as well so it's easy to see when it's ready or done. Um, the handles are cool to the touch so it's perfect. Um, so you can always use and stir fry as you go. Um, of course it's a stainless steel 5 ply um, construction so it heats up evenly throughout the cooking so you don't get that cold or warm spot in your um, cookware. So as you can see our fried rice is just about done. I'm just gonna mix it all up just a little bit and my stainless steel surprising lot for most people who are afraid of stainless steel this could really uh, function as a non-stick cookware if you use it properly so we're almost done with the cauliflower rice I'm just gonna add a dash of salt to that one and some green onions to top it but that's a rice Super easy.